Supporting military veterans with physical and emotional disabilities is the aim of Merchants Bonding Company's 2016 Bill Warner Senior Memorial Charity Golf Classic. The Puppy Jake Foundation will use the money raised to train service dogs for veterans. Veterans like Jared Deers of Oskaloosa, Iowa, and his service dog, Bucky. I was deployed from 2007 to 2008 to Iraq, and then I went to White Sands Missile Range in New Mexico, and I was attached to 2nd Engineer Battalion, which is route clearance, and then I was deployed from 2010 to 2011, and I was deployed to Afghanistan. I got hit head on by a dump truck um, when I was in Afghanistan. It completely crippled my vehicle and uh, there was casualties uh, when the dump truck uh, hit my vehicle. I got a, a scar on the side of my face, another one underneath my neck and another one to the back of my head and some hearing loss. I got uh, two traumatic brain injuries. Jared not only had severe physical injuries, but worse, he had to endure the emotional trauma of seeing teammates die and witness up close how warfare in that region uses children. Those scars are harder to heal. There was certain circumstances where we were engaged and we lost members of our team and then we had to witness certain things due to our rules of engagement and some things in, involved children. After my vehicle got hit, I had to deal with a, a basically a mob of people, uh, 200 plus people, and it was just me and another soldier that was on the ground, uh, and I had a fear of big crowds of people. When Jared learned about the Puppy Jake Foundation, he quickly filled out an application. He got Bucky in September 2015. Bucky was specially trained for Jared's specific needs. It's really nice to have somebody there constantly. He is there to help me integrate back into society and help me live a normal, healthy, thriving life. Aside from the emotional support that helps Jared fight the effects of PTSD, Bucky assists with his physical limitations, including the brain injuries that left him without a sense of smell or taste. He'll actually let me know when I'm burning something in the kitchen. And when all the lights go out in the house, like I'll call him over to me. He will actually lead me up the stairs to my bedroom. And it's, it's great because like sometimes I'll just grab onto him or his tail and he'll just literally just like take me up the stairs. Bucky just helps me like if I drop something, like if I drop my slipper, like he'll get it for me. Bucky's presence has a positive impact on Jared's young daughter, Sophia, as well. She's three, she's beautiful. She's full of joy, <laughs> laughter. She likes to play with, with me and Bucky. It's, it's great to watch the interaction. There's never a dull moment, really. Jared knows his life without Bucky would be a lot different. I would probably be a hermit. I would probably be cooped up in my house, fearful of going out in the public. Before, I really didn't like going in like big crowds at all. Now, like I'll actually take my time in like stores and actually look at prices. Where before, like I just like grabbed it, threw it in my cart, and just got out as quick as possible. Jared has a message for other veterans and their family members. Some people will actually try to drown their sorrows in. Uh, liquor, for example, and look for their answer at the bottom of a bottle. I honestly think that, you know, some of these, these other veterans out there could honestly benefit instead of turning to alcohol and suicide, it, it will benefit them tremendously. And if we could save one veteran, just one, it's a great cause. It's not a lost cause, it's for something. If you dwell about things you can't change, things won't ever change. So you just put one foot in front of the other and just keep going. Help us raise money to train service dogs for our veterans. Golf with us, spread the word on social media, or just donate. We'll tally up our fundraising Monday, September 19th after the charity golf tournament. See how you can help at merchantsbonding.com.